guys, it's Brax, or Brady, and today, I'm here, with Halo 5, and the Guardian. <laughs> so, in this episode of Halo 5, I will be doing some prefab reviews, so let's head over to the first prefab! First off, is the Guardian. Let's get a closer look at the Guardian here. This thing is enormous. It it's taking up literally the entire map. Great job to uh, whoever made this prefab. Let's head over to uh, the next prefab. Next up, we have Godzilla. That's right. Someone made Godzilla in Halo 5. This thing is also almost the size of the Guardian over there. And it took me so long to be able to spawn it without my game crashing. <laughs> Great detail. Awesome way of building it. Thank you to whoever made Godzilla. Alright, let's move on to the next prefab. Alright, next up, we have... The Uni Goose. This is one of the most popular prefabs on the most liked page. And I thought we just had to have it in this episode of Prefabs Reviews. So, works perfectly fine like a normal uh, mongoose. It's just decorated so fabulously. And I love it. It's one of the best ones ever made. Alright, let's move on to the next mongoose. Next up, we have... The go-kart mongoose. You could use it as racing. Oh, and falling off the cliff. That's that's also good. Just that's what it's for. You just gotta like fall off the cliff with the go-kart. It's amazing. Okay, let's move on to the next mongoose. The last mongoose we have is the Covenant mongoose, dressed up as all Ely Perfection Covenant ishness. And I fell off the cliff again. Ah. Let's just move on to the next prefab. These mongooses do not like to stay on this grid. Or should I say, mong mongai? Mon mongai. <laughs> plural, plural for mongoose. No, it's still mongoose. <laughs> it's still mongoose, never mind. <laughs> All right, the next prefab I'm gonna be keeping a long time in this series is the Halo Combat Evolved Teleporter. Let's see how it works. Whoosh! Ta-da! That was it. We were just up there. Ta-da! It's amazing. All that noise is amazing, too. Okay. <laughs> see you guys in the next prefab. Next up, we've got the drivable mammoth in Halo 5. Let's go check out the interior. Pop up here and let's go in. So it looks like this is the first layer of the the, uh, the mammoth, and then uh, we'll go up the stairs, and here we are, we're at the top, best designed mammoth in Halo 5. It's amazing. All right, let's see how uh, we can drive this. Let's go. So right here, you can kind of see it. This is not actually a mammoth. It's it's a hidden scorpion. So all you do is go here, you drive it, and look. How big this thing is! It's amazing! Here we are, the last prefab of this episode. I saved the best for last. Welcome to the Batmobile! Yes, and it is drivable! Let's drive the Batmobile! I'm actually not totally sure what. Oh, I can hear it, never mind. This is actually a warthog dressed up to look like the Batmobile. That is awesome. Props to whoever made this prefab. Thank you. I'm going to be enjoying this for a long time. Alright, on that note, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode of Prefabs Reviews, comment down below of what prefabs I should look at next. Slap that like button. 
and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Thank you guys so much for watching again. Peace!